Hi, and welcome back to Experience Inspirations. Press your way right on in. Press your way right on in. And remember through prayer and supplication to press your way throughout your day. If you're new to the channel, Inspirations welcomes you. It's always my prayer that the scriptures and topics we discuss here on Inspirations be an uplifting and encouragement to you and you'll share it out to someone else close to you. Today I wanted to come on and talk to you all about the use of your hands. The use of your hands. How many of you all know that God will get his glory through the work of your hands with what little do you have? He will get the work done and he's going to get the glory. When others may question how they're not going to be, be aware, they're not going to acknowledge that God's going to get that glory for the work of your hands. And today I was studying in the scripture I want to reference is Exodus 4 when God was talking to Moses and he told Moses to lead the Israel Israelites out, out of Egypt. And he questioned God and came back and said, what if they do not listen? And God told him to use what he had in his hand. At that time, Moses had a stick, a stick in his hand. That stick that he had, God told him to throw it into the ground. So Moses was skeptical, but he threw that stick into the ground and it became a snake. When it became the snake, it scared Moses, quite naturally. It scared him. So God told him at that point, grab that snake by the tail. Grab him by his tail. Moses indeed did that. Now, when he told him to grab it by his tail, that's in Exodus, two, Exodus 4 and 4 and 4. And it says, And the Lord said unto him, Moses, put forth thy hand and take it by the tail. And he caught and he put forth his hand and caught it, and it became a rod in his hand. That same rod is what he used to let the Israelites knew that God had sent him to lead them to Egypt. So to be encouraged to someone out there that is working with their hands, which we all do, let the work that you do with your hands be the uplifting and edifying as if you're working for Christ and uplifting his kingdom. From Experience Inspirations, thank you for watching. And until the next video, I love each and every last one of you all. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Until the next video, where we'll continue up in courage. I had to just drop off and do a, I want to share this one with you. See ya.